Well, my name is Damien Hobgood from Satellite Beach, Florida. What's the last song that got stuck in your head while you were surfing? I got two kids, and they're always watching this dang Miley Cyrus stuff. So I got the best of both worlds stuck in my head. It's kind of a trip, because I kept looking around thinking people knew, knew what I was singing. And I'm like, do these people think I'm the biggest fruit top? If you knew the world was going to end in two years, until then. How do you spend the next two years? Exactly the same way I'm spending it now. What is your power animal? It's a dugong. It's like a manatee, but it's got the tail of like a dolphin. The first time I saw one was in Indo. Basically like a hybrid manatee. What's your favorite board right now to mention? 6 0 18 and a quarter, 2 and a quarter. You know, it's just pretty out there. I think it's pretty easy for me. I'd pick a world title over the video part just because that's what I do. I compete and I love it. I love putting it online in like a intense moment. I think the sport of surfing, I don't know where it's head. I think it's heading down the tubes. You know, a week off for me is just chilling with my family, going down to the beach, surfing, barbecue, Watching some football, watching some type of sport. Yeah, I'm a sport freak. What are your thoughts on golf? Thoughts on golf are it's pretty cool, but it's too expensive. I just can't get my head around spending like 50 to 100 bucks to go hit a ball around. Does surfing still make you feel like it did when you were a kid and you was like, you know, that enthusiasm? Like it's, it's your job now, but wow. do you still get that excited about going out and surfing? Probably get more excited now. I think when I was around like my mid twenties, maybe took it for granted a little bit too much. Not anymore. Especially now that I know 2012 is coming. I'll take nothing for granted.